Hello everyone, this is Melanie from Melanie B's Creative Studio. And guess what today is? It is New Year's Eve. So happy New Year, yay! Now I know I've said this in a couple other videos, so depending on which one goes first, you might get told Happy New Year about 20 times from me. But you guys, we all need a very good New Year, don't we? I mean, like, I don't know about you guys, but I am ready to just leap out of 2020. I've had a lot going on this week personally, and I thought what better thing to cheer me up than a brown box? <laughs> because you guys know what has been in my last several brown boxes. So you know what I'm about to discuss. Let me pull this out and let's get started. So what do we have here? This is a Winter Dream Paint by Number by Shipper. I did not get this at Hershner's this time. I got it on Amazon. And for those of you who have seen my storefront on Amazon, I actually, I don't sell products. What I do is I have a list of products that I have found on Amazon for you. And if you click on the item and you order it, then I get a little bit of a percentage. So basically it's like I'm your personal shopper. Um, you don't pay a thing extra when you do it that way. It just gives me a little bit of a, a little bit of help financially, which is lovely right now. So I wanted to talk about this brand new shipper. I haven't even taken off the plastic wrap yet. We're going to take a look at it because this is one of the triptychs and what that means is it's just it's three sections three panels that once i'm done with this i can frame them each individually together like they show it in this visual on the front of the box and then because it's got three sections it's called a triptych so let me open this up get this plastic off here we we're not going to spend a lot of time on the canvas and the contents of this package because I want to swatch these paints and make sure that these paints are as fabulous as all the other ones and all the other kits that I've tried from Shipper. This palette here has me a little bit afraid, but I'm going to be honest. I would never have purchased this painting from any other company probably besides Shipper because if they can't get these yellows and oranges right, nobody's gonna be able to. It is just so hard to find good yellows and oranges. And I know these tr these companies are really trying, but it's just difficult. So that is what we're gonna do right now. And I'm gonna get it opened and let's swatch some paint. Now I should mention, I'm living vicariously through this painting because we don't get snow in the South very often we get ice so when we get ice everybody starts sort you know driving around like they can drive because they've got a four by four and it doesn't work that way in ice you can drive in it in snow but <laughs> but when you're going around a windy curvy back road that gets no sunlight and you hit a patch of ice Bye, Felicia. You off the, the road. You out in the middle of the cornfield. I mean, like, I don't even know if there's a cornfield around here, but you know what I'm saying. So, yeah, I bought this painting because I love winter scenes because we just don't get a lot of uh, snow. So, here are our panels. We've got our center panel, and I'm not going to pull it out, but you guys know gray lines, gray numbers. Beautiful, e beautifully easy to cover with the paint. We have two other panels that will go on either side of this piece. And we've got our number stickers that I'm going to put on my paint pots before I ever swatch them. And we also have our brochure that just shows you all of the designs that they have available from Shipper um, for paint by numbers. All right, so let's take a look at this bag. Usually this bag is gonna contain my, whoops, sorry, my reference guide and an instructional manual. So here we have our reference guide. This information here will show me how to number, very simple. And that is what I will do first. So you guys, I am going to go take a little break and I'm gonna swatch these paints, and then I'm gonna come back and we're gonna talk about whether this 
particular kit is as fabulous as, as the previous kits I've brought to you from Shipper. All right, I will be back. Well, okay now, I've gone ahead and I've swatched all 36 paints and it didn't turn out like I expected. Um, it turned out actually a little bit better than I expected. <laughs> I know that's not what y'all thought I was gonna say, but uh, I was just trying to pull one over on you. Um, so anyway, you know, some of these lighter pastel colors, I really kind of expected to be able to see through those. I can a tiny, tiny bit on these two, uh, but for the most part, I feel like because I use gray paint pots when I did these swatches, and there's gray numbers and lines on this, that those are gonna be opaque once I finally put these down and I've got gesso down, down on my surface. And the yellow that I was really concerned about is really nice. Let me get the light up close here. Um, this yellow I thought was gonna be the worst. Now I did put a little bit extra thick on that by accident. So it might be that that is, you know, not gonna be as opaque as it looks. But y'all, every one of these looks opaque. So the bottom line is I'm not gonna be struggling. I don't have to hate this palette that I would normally have hated with all of these orangey yellows and, you know, the pastels and everything. So once again, Shipper has impressed me. And, you know, I know you're probably like, okay, why do you keep bringing on Shipper videos? Well, you know, now I've actually done the legit or scam on Shippers and I've done several videos on Shippers, but I like to share when I get a new painting and I just ordered a couple more. So I'll be back with probably in the future with a few more Shippers, um, but I am going to make a kind of a resolution for the new year that I'm going to be better about not ordering anything that I'm not gonna be able to use. So I'm not going to make promises. I usually don't make resolutions because I feel like when you do that, you set yourself up for failure. Um, I usually make resolutions like, I'm gonna gain 20 pounds this year because I know that's probably more realistic than me saying I'm gonna lose 60. But, <laughs> You know, everybody's got their own way. So I'm not really making a resolution, but I am going to really try to work hard on keeping a budget when it comes to what I order each month for legit or scam videos and for business expenses and really try to keep a you know some control on that. Uh, but these shippers could definitely lead me astray. I can just tell you. So that is it for today, you guys. I hope you love this piece. I think it's gonna be fabulous. And you know, it's like everything else I say, I cannot wait to work on it. Well, let's just put this one in the queue because it's gonna go in there. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, join me on Patreon, go visit us at the group, and check out all my social media and follow me there. Okay, I will see you back soon. Thanks as always for watching.